okay as you can see you guys this is a messy process so wear something that you do not mind getting messed up okay i'm gonna tell you what other things i told you what you need yeah now i already pre put my stuff that i'm putting there i'm making um what's it called <laughs> i'm making unicorn flakes basically and i want it to be a white oh crap i want it to be white so i'm got my versa gel in and i added coconut and i'm just mixing it up to get it to the perfect consistency that i like it to be i might have to add some more i might not let's see how i put so much because coconut it usually thickens it and i don't like when it does that now another thing that you see coconut moisturize your lips i want to put something that heals your lips so i'm gonna add a couple of drops of vitamin e this is vitamin e i don't want to add too much because i do not want it to darken up i want it to be as clear as i can have it i don't really like thick gloss i make my gloss on how i would like to wear it that's how i make it the consistency of it smashing this because it's some on the spoon <laughs> and i'm trying not to go back inside the thing and get more because uh yeah don't want to do that i ain't making nothing but a couple of them so which this is like for more than a couple but yeah we're gonna do what we have to do yeah because this to see is getting how i would like it Not too thick, not too thin. You go by the consistency, you would like it. Getting out the bowl. The bowl. Once I get to the consistency that I like. okay but it seems a little watery to me i like it but it's not it's too watery and that consistency will go off of your lips fast okay so i have another spoon i'm gonna get a brand new spoon out of here and i'm gonna get me some more base I have the huge thing y'all that's why i have to do it like that don't mind my shirt it's a messy job you know you have to love doing this in order to do it and like i said put on something especially if you must be like me i'm planning on getting like a uh, you know like a cooking roll <laughs> plan on getting one of those because i am messing up clothes like all right but um this right here is something I like to clean in anyway, so it's not too bad, you know. That's perfect right there, y'all. Now see, yeah, that's not that's not gonna be too sticky. Mhm. Mm usually when you keep like stirring it the coconut oil that's in it it like makes it thicken up and then you will have to add more what you look like that's what's going on see see it the consistency went a little thicker what you gotta do you gotta add more coconut <laughs> add more coconut You're gonna stir of course mm. 
takes time to get the right consistency that you would like. But if that's, you know, if you like that first consistency for your lip gloss, then, you know, that's fine. However you like it for yours, that's, that's, it's always the right way. There's no wrong way to do this. Of course, have gloves and things. Clean bowls and clean spoons and, you know, clean everything. That's the only way you won't do it, right? Okay. That's how I like it. So, I'm going to take one of these disaffected wipes for my gloves. Sometimes I change out gloves, oh my gosh, a lot. Because, like, a lot of times, like, when I'm changing different stuff, anyway, I change. I change gloves. This a light off, a light off disinfected um, white. Disinfect my gloves real quick. Now I get my handy dandy scissors. Cut this. Brand new. Put that out the pack. I get the ones that um have like a top on the end. Then you get this, cut it on the end, and you cut this like half, however you feel comfortable doing it, but it you cut it off so it can fit on top of here. That's how you get to the bottom of tubes. You have to put that on. And voila, there you have it. I keep a bag right here to throw my stuff away in. So, now I'm about to put the flavor in. I'm using cotton candy. For the flavor. I mean, it is a unicorn. So, why not get put a candy flavor? I like a lot of flavor, y'all. I'm sorry. <laughs> I like my stuff that tastes like how it smells. And it does. Because that's really, it's for candy. Now, see, I did make this a little. So, I wouldn't advise y'all to do that. Because I just messed it up. Because I put too much liquid in it. But, it's okay. I'll just add some more. I have my handy dandy spoon that I got earlier. This is how I end up making a lot of stuff, y'all. But I might have to find something else to make because honestly, you guys, the reason why I did the other thing off camera because it's very time consuming. So I might decide to do something else with cotton candy flavor because I only ha I'm only filling up like two. So yeah, so I'm just gonna take thickness back up the way I like it. Then we're gonna be ready. We're ready to put it inside of the tube. And please don't mind my shirt. It, this is just gloss, man. <laughs> this is the life of me. It's crazy because I literally just got it out the dry, uh, dryer and. Look at it now. Oh my gosh, it's beautiful. a little bit more um yeah i'm gonna add a little bit more coconut oil that's the only thing that i don't like about using coconut oil is 
how it thickens. No other substance that I use, no other oil that I use do this. Now, look how much is in the bowl now. Yep, the life of me. That's what I got there. I like it a little thick because the thicker it is, the more it'll stay longer on your lips. But I like it to be thick and soft at the same time, if you understand what I'm saying. I like it to be soft and not sticky and not super thick. I don't want it to be super thick on the lips, but kind of thick like in between. That's just how I do. Now, I do sell um, the starter kit. It's for a pretty reasonable price. Everything comes in it gloves. Eight ounce um, Versa gel. Two flavors. Tubes. And you have um, both of these things come in there. I don't know why my brain is like, uh, you know. <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with my brain today, you guys. I guess I'm tired. I haven't been doing a lot of stuff today. Syringe and what's that other thing called? Pipe it. <laughs> and of course the color. The pigment micro powder. Yeah, I like that. That's an okay consistency. I'm thinking, should I add a little more? It looked perfect though. I'm gonna add a tiny bit more, y'all. Just a tiny bit. <laughs> I just need to get it perfect, perfect, perfect though. 